Basket for Smaragda in the warehouse. She's waiting. What does it mean to be truly righteous? To never succumb to temptation, or to take a vow of chastity despite constant temptation? Our heroine did not know the answer to this question, and preferred never to dwell on it. If it were up to her, she would have chosen the quiet life of a nun. However, destiny had something different in store for her. Sorry, maybe I can help. You're the last person I need right now. Get lost! Sorry.
I don't really know how to... Oh, forgive me. For, forgive me. Forgive me. I'm going to change that one. I should go. Oh, I, 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 I should go. I, I, I should go. Sorry. 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 Yes. For the sake of the prayers of all the... S Stesha, do you have something prepared for Smaragda? It's cold today, isn't it? <laughs> oh, potato. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. The sisters loved Indica. Christian love is known to be patient, merciful, and faithful. However, in a lowly human sense, they didn't love her that much. To be completely honest, they didn't love her at all. Many of them felt nothing but disgust for her. Indica, however, was not to blame. Were it not for the voice that was inculcating ideas in her, unforgivable for a Christian, she would have been a virtuous and rather mediocre nun. Indica's biggest dream was for that voice to leave her alone once and for all. Her entire life became a struggle, a painful resistance. No matter how hard she tried, no matter how much she tortured herself, the voice grew louder and more convincing every day.
drink some water. Useless labor is the basis of spiritual development. Obedience is above fasting or prayers. Indica didn't understand why she needed to retrieve the water from the well if there was a pump next door that took it from a sacred spring. She didn't understand why drinking from the spring was allowed, but cooking soup was a sin. The well was only about 15 meters away from the spring. It was not possible to have any other water there. Even a tenth of it is the same. They say on Epiphany, even a drop of holy water blesses an entire canister. If that were true, a couple of evaporated drops from the spring would bless the puddles beneath her.
We haven't eaten even ten of them. With God's help, we'll make it to spring. No way. Sisters won't eat after her. Mother, the sign of the cross saves from the plague. But this, God forgive me. Glory to Smaragda, don't tempt me. I'm sending Evdokia to you. Don't let this one into the refectory. O Son of God, accept me on this day as communicant of thy secret summer, for I shall not divulge thy mysteries to thy foes. I shall give thee no kiss akin to Judas, but as an outlaw shall I confess thee. Remember me, O Lord, in thy kingdom. May my communion of thy immaculate mysteries, O Lord, not be judged or condemned, but heal the body and soul. It is forbidden to leave the convent without a blessing. Despite her requests, Indica had not been blessed to leave for a full year. When she was tasked with delivering the letter, it took her completely by surprise. Even though she did not know the contents of that letter, she could not shake the feeling that it would play an extremely important, perhaps critical, role in her life. Now that I know what's in it. What is in it? What's in it? What's in it? What's in it?
the sake of the prayers of all the saints, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy on us. Tisha, I need to go to the other side. Georgie, pirate, be quiet. The animals feel the unholiness. They're just happy to see me. Tisha, I'm sorry. The animals feel the unholiness. I brought you some apples. Or Lovka, your favorite. Tisha, I must hurry to the train. <gasps> Tisha, what have you done? Your steps are all wet. You'll slip and fall again. Don't worry, Tikhon, I understand. Forgive me, for Christ's sake. Illogical and
Damn, Tikhon has the key. Oh, what an imbecile. Indica loved Tikhon. Imbecile was a medical diagnosis, so she was just using the word literally. In any case, Tikhon couldn't hear her. Hypocrisy isn't really a virtue, is it? It was as if the convent didn't want to let her go. Even though she knew there was no place closer to God, she yearned to leave it, at least for a short time. Not true! I... Now I have come to thee, my lord and God, a sinful and burdened one, not having the boldness of... Was wounded, so have I also fallen through my sins, and my soul is wounded. To whom shall I flee for healing, if not to thee, the compassionate Samaritan? She surely didn't go out of her way to use that skill. Just like her personal hygiene, always at lunch, she would carefully clean the devil's work from her dentures with her finger. Indica hated endless prayers that were repeated so much they lost their original meaning. Hated to smile at Sister Martha's toothless jokes. Hated the fuming candles, the rotting potatoes, the never-ending advice and lectures, the humility, the fear of God, signing the cross over her mouth after every yawn, before entering the temple, after crying, after leaving the temple, after entering the refectory, praying before entering her cell, before going to sleep, before having a meal, repenting what she had thought or heard, listening to the depressing sister's choir, the dissonant change ringing, signing the cross, fasting, apologizing, pretending to be interested in the lives of the saints, apologizing, repenting, praying, apologizing, endless oaths, the black veils, apologizing, crying, apologizing, apologizing, apologizing. Indica hated Smaragda's tasteless cabbage soup, the smell of rotting old women that even incense could not cover. Ha! Your friend is barren of good deeds, but I beseech thee, O Lord, pour out upon me a drop of thy mercy and cleanse me, for I am defiled by many sins, and I will praise thy name all of the days of my life. I have recklessly forgotten thy glory, O Father, and among sinners I have scattered the riches which thou gavest me. As of old, thou didst raise up the paralytic, O Lord God, by thy godlike care and might, raise up my soul, which is palsied by diverse sins and transgressions, and by answering me deeds and acts, that saved I may cry out, Glory to thy power, O compassion of Christ. Lectures, the humility, the fear of God, signing the cross over her mouth after every yawn, before entering the temple, after crying, after leaving the temple, after entering the refectory, praying before entering her cell, before going to sleep, before having a meal, repenting what she had thought or heard, listening to the depressing sister's choir, the dissonant change ringing, signing the cross, fasting, apologizing, pretending... One, thou hast received the gospel as a martyr, thou art never turned away as the brother. Oaths, the black veils, apologizing, crying, apologizing, apologizing, apologizing. Indica hated Smarat. As the prodigal, I have sinned before thee, O merciful Father. Receive me a penitent and make me as one of thy hired servants. Because of thy boundless mercy and compassion, I dare to approach thee, O Christ. Receive me as thou didst the publican, the prodigal, and the harlot. 
For as thou in thy deep wisdom hast had compassion on us, so also in these latter days hast thou made us a new body. From her dentures with her finger. Unseen grace, for who can tell of thy mighty works, O Christ, or who can number the multitude of thy wonders? As of old thou didst raise up the perilous. Hated the fuming candles, the rotting potatoes, the never-ending advice and lectures. For as thou in thy deep wisdom hast had compassion on us, so also in these latter days hast thou made us anew by thy blood shedding. My soul is wasted with evil in this barren of good deeds, but I beseech thee. Praying before entering her cell. And was wounded, so have I also fallen through my sins. Listening to the depressing sisters' choir, the dissonant change ringing, signing the. In his mercy and compassion, I dare to approach thee, O Christ. Receive me as thou didst the publican, prodigal, and the harlot. Now I have come unto thee, my Lord and God, a sinful and burdened one, not having the boldness to look up into the heights of. Apologizing! Indica hated Smaragda's tasteless cabbage soup, the smell of rotting old women, that even incense could be. Lord, I've just one, thou hast received the gospel as. Even if you have Sorry. Jesus Christ, what, what, what are you doing here? You. The cloisters is here! Huh. What, what, what nun is fine. The conventual is here! The nun. Listen, you're, you're lucky to bump into me. I, I, I keep missing and I, I'm no good at this. Just what? Go, 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 go. Get out of here. What? What? I, Who's there? to bump into him. He's not a great shot. <laughs> yes. Sorry, I can help if you let me. No, I don't think it can be helped. His nobleness has decided to listen to the visitation one last time. So let him listen. Don't interrupt. Excuse me, what, what happened here? Have you heard the joke about a crowbar in a train toilet? So, there was this train with a bunch of convicts. They put a spring between two carriages while the train was moving. They tried to plan an escape, I guess. How many died? Mostly fugitives. Many of them were shot. They've had to care for the sick. Me? Of course. We often have to. Then come with us to the station. All the wounded are there. Says the wounded old 
infestation and then injects a corpse with morphine. Maybe out of respect for his dying wish, or for the size of his epaulets. What do you think?
husband? Husband? I guess he was loved. No. Stop! Lost your nerve, huh? Why do you stop me? Since when do you obey me? Don't worry. Fear is a natural reaction, life-saving in most cases. What is your goal? To help the girl or show what a hero you are? To help. Exactly. If you're trying to help, there's no chance. Calculating chances in a time like this. Listen to her. Doesn't like getting abandoned in the middle of an act. What? What? Did you see the size of that thing? Maybe you wanted to join them. Uh, 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 nope. 
perdre. Hold on. Wait! Quiet. Stop yelling. You've saved me. And I, I, I've i saved someone too. Poor girl. A, a little more and she could have... Oh, Lord have mercy on for us. And you didn't see. She got away. Well, well, I, did, I didn't... I don't know how much. But if it weren't for me... I can't deliver us in this room. Sorry, w what is your name? Ilya. Indica. You know, they say that every hour that a patient doesn't get medical attention, their chance of survival is halved. Crazy thing to say, to be honest. It makes no sense to generalize like that. No idea where to take it or where it came from. Sister! Did you arrive safely? No incidents? Kasyuk, is that you? Wait a second! <laughs> <laughs> Hey, right. you drop your weapon. D drop it. You drop your your weapon. No, no. Throw, throw your rifle here. Don't turn your don't turn your conscience with sin. You're going nowhere, mate. All right. Manage. I've got nothing to lose. <laughs> Fine, just uh, don't shoot, all right? Do it like this. Get, get on. Get on him. I'm telling you, go. Go. Get, get on. Get going! Get going! I'm telling you! I'm not 
running anymore! Oh, we'll shoot! You bitch! You fucking bitch! Hooligan! Come back! Hooligan, stop where you are! Right now! I've heard enough to stop! Hey. Hey. Are you wounded? Get up. No, 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 you don't need that. With me or with them, up to you. so much sorry we're doing no more than five verse an hour though whoa, whoa, whoa. how do you understand it huh is he talking about the word versed or how to start an engine I grew up in a bike shop my father sold them in Spasov why in Spasov no in Godadishi I've never been to Spasov that's where I grew up <laughs> the man's logic is flawless. Uh, are you embarrassed to be so close to a man? She's been waiting for that. He's quite a looker, huh? Thick boy. I must smell awful. 
Well, they, they kept us in the train for three days. Oh, don't worry. <laughs> she likes it. Whoa! Pardon. Come on, come on! Grab her tips! Hey! Stop pretending. She's just like the men you imagine in your room when you're... Enough! All right, c calm down. Is he a bandit or a sissy? Hold on to your seat, for God's sake.